Welcome everyone! As February 2023, the Nebukasa team has announced OpenAI support for Assist. For those who don't know, OpenAI is the company behind ChatGPT and Assist is the virtual assistant introduced last month in Home Assistant. Yes, you heard me right, I called it virtual assistant, not voice assistant, because currently it doesn't have a voice. You can only interact with it by text, so I'm not exactly sure what to call it. It's currently in the early stages of development, but don't get me wrong, because everything is handled locally, so it's hack fast. So, let's see how we can integrate it with OpenAI's ChatGPT in order to make it better understand and generate natural language. We will discuss the pros and cons of doing so and finally I will give you my personal opinion. The setup process is actually painless. Head over to your integrations and add a new integration. Search for OpenAI Conversation and now open the link in the video description. If you don't have an OpenAI account, create one, it's free. Otherwise, log in into your account and generate a new API key. Copy it and paste it inside Home Assistant and that's it. Now, if you open Assist from your dashboard, you can see that in the bottom right, it says powered by OpenAI. This means that you have successfully integrated chat GPT inside your home assistant and you can ask it questions about your home. For example, now I can ask it, is it Fabio's bedroom colder than the rest of the house? And if it is, what is the exact difference? And here it is its response. But what is the catch? Although now Assist can respond to some complex questions about your smart home, it can't control any of your devices. That's because ChatGPT doesn't actually have access to control your home. Every time you make a request, Home Assistant will provide ChatGPT with the latest information about your home and show you its response. This means that you will also lose fast response times since all requests are not computed locally anymore. What you also need to know is that OpenAI offers a credit of $18 to spend for the first three months of use. After that, each request will cost you one or two cents at most. So, what do I think about OpenAI integration? Given that Assist has great potential, but at this stage of development it's not very practical to use other than from a smartwatch running Wear OS, integrating it with ChatGPT could be a very neat feature for many. If this video was useful, please don't forget to leave a like and consider subscribing. Bye!